It's Friday. By in today, guys, warm up is gonna be two rounds. We're gonna do 10 power skips. Ready for a power skip? You're gonna be drop up, opposite arm. Drop up, opposite arm. So drive that left knee, right arm, drive off the leg. Make it explosive, explosive. 10 reps. You can bring them using, yep. 10 cross side to side, get in the wide stance. Turn into a T. Crossover. Keep that back nice and flat. If you can touch your toe, touch your toe. If not, go to where you can. Get a nice spin through the midline. 10 per side, T, T spine opener. Hands and knees. We're gonna shift our weight back a little bit. Take your left hand, put it beside your right hand. Hand behind the head, down, and open up. We're gonna do 10 of these. Switch to the other side, hand crosses over, it's directly underneath my face. Hand behind my head from neutral position to open. Neutral to open. 10 per side, and then we're gonna do 10 per side, shoulder, external rotation. Now you need to use this, you can go get yours, go grab yours. Uh, front rack position, okay? PVC pipe, it's gonna come around the elbow, and you're gonna pull up and back down. Up and back down. Nice and slow and controlled. Trying to get some external rotation happening through that shoulder. Once again, opposite side. PVC pipes up my hand. It's gonna come around my elbow. And 10 minutes. We are gonna hit some dumbbell gym, dumbbell Olympic lifting. And we are going to work on some awkward footwork. So the first thing we're going to do is hang dumbbell split snatch. Ready? Going to be a little bit quiet for the video, okay? Hang dumbbell split snatch. You're going to do 10 on one arm and then 10 on the other arm. We are going to, in the split, we're going to alternate our feet each time. This is what's going to be a little bit awkward. Okay, so starting on my right arm, I stand up, I'm going to go into the hang position, overhead, I split this first time with my left foot forward, step my feet back together, I'll come back down to the hang, and now i got to go right foot forward, bring my feet back together, oop, I didn't do my right feet that time, front foot comes back first, you'll do 10 on the one arm, and then switch to the other side, so the arm stays the same, we're going to switch the feet and keep messing up on that side. 10 on one arm, 10 on the other, alternating feet each time. Rest for 90 seconds and we'll do four total sets of that. After that, we are going to do the same thing with cleans from the hang position. Split cleans. From the hang position, feet together. Alternate feet, feet together. Ten on one arm, ten on the other arm, rest for 90 seconds, four sets. A couple things we want to work on when we're getting to that split stance position. Shoulders need to stay stacked over the hips, and we want to keep this in line with that position. So when I'm snatching, my feet move, my torso stay in the same spot. Now how do I keep my chest upright? The, the major flaw usually is in the back leg staying straight and pushing us forward. Okay, so bend that back knee. Nice flat foot on the front foot, loaded between both legs, back knees bent, and we're loaded on that knee. I go to the other side, once again, stacked, back knee bent on my toe, and nice and flat on the front foot. Same thing happens in my clean, torso stays upright, split, bent, flat foot, bend back knee, and in the toe, bring the feet back together. Really keep those shoulders over top of the hips. Our workout today is going to be a 9 minute arm wrap. We're going to do 12 right arm push jerks. We're going to do some hops over the dumbbell. 9, or sorry, 12 push jerks on the opposite arm. And then some hops. So, push jerk. Put that dumbbell in the front rack position. Dip, drive, punch under. Dip, drive, punch under. Dip, drive, punch under. We'll do 12 of them. 
Double down. One, two, three, four, five. 24. Other arm. Dip, drive, drive. Notice my catch position. Okay? I'm in a quarter squat here. If you're push pressing, none of these reps count. Okay? We must push your this. Dip, dip, drive, punch under. Bunny, come here, come here. Dip, drive, punch under. Come here, please. You're okay? Come here. Come on. You want to show them how to do the next one? Let's see. Come here, please. Mwah. Can you show them how you hop over the dumbbell? Okay, do it like you did before. Whoa, good job. And again. Whoa, good job. Okay, so make sure we're push jerking. We dip drive. We catch in a quarter squat. We stand up, then we bring the dumbbell down. 12 on one, 12 on the other, with the hops in between. If you guys aren't comfortable jumping over an object, put it off to the side, get a line, hop over, but don't just go just over the line. Challenge yourself to jump as high. Think that there's a stack of a couple fences there, and then get a little bit higher. So if we're used to just, just hopping here, start to think about jumping up and over, up and over, okay? Um, Ab circuit, everybody loved last Friday, so we're gonna hit another one this week. Um, this one's going to be 20 seconds, 20 seconds, 20 seconds, 30 seconds, and then a 30 second rest. So we're gonna go through that three times. So the first thing we're gonna do is 20 seconds of V snaps from a hollow position. V. Then we're gonna hold hollow position for 20 seconds. Then we're gonna do 20 seconds of Russian twists sitting in this position. We need to be leaned back, feet off the ground, and we're gonna touch, 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 touch. We're gonna flip over into a Superman position. We're gonna do 30 seconds of pulses, hands together, feet together, and pulse, pulse. Think about holding that top position for one second, 1,000, back down, and we will rest for 30 seconds. Couple performance points on those. The V snap and the hollow hold. Try to keep that lower back engaged in the floor. We should not be able to push your hand underneath our lower back. This should be tucked under, okay? Push that under. If we need to, if this is too hard, bending the knee or bringing our hands in will allow us to get into that position. Just to show you that on the ground, we're in the hollow position and our back's around and we can't do it. Bend the knees and or Bring the hands in here, and we should be able to push that back into the ground, okay? Tuck that in, squeeze, clench, clench, clench. Sit in that position. We're gonna go through that three times. Have a good workout. See you tomorrow.